If you have an ever-growing list of electronics, your work laptop, your personal laptop, your kids' Chromebooks, your kids' gamepads, your wife's work phone, your wife's personal phone, you name it, you are probably struggling to manage all the device, adapters, and the cables. Trust me, you are not alone. I've been thinking about this neat and a compact solution that is not taking too much of a space, but efficiently handle the storage and, at the same time, get them charged. So follow me to check out how to build this charging station. So first of all, you need to understand how you're going to use this shelf for charging devices. So ideally, for example, this is the MacBook Pro I have, which is the biggest device among all the other stuff. I would like to insert into the shelf for charging. So you will need to have access to the side of it for the charging port. In order for me to do that, you have to measure the device first. So my MacBook Pro measures about 14 inches in width and shorter than 10 inches in height. So I figured if I have a shelf about 12 inches by 11 inches, it's gonna fit all my devices. Today's devices are really thin. For example, this MacBook Pro is only half inch in thickness. So I decided to have a few one inch thick shelves and some two inches uh, thick shelves for my really, really old devices. I think that will fit all my stuff very well. Next, it to go through my favorite collection of wood material. They're all from my previous projects. I end up choosing three quarters plywood for the siding and then one eighth for the shelves. Then, following with a lot of cuts. Okay, I've got all my cuts down. Here are the measurements. I end up cutting seven pieces of shelves, which were constructed into eight slots of storage space. Then it's time to assemble the station. You probably have noticed, the base has an extra piece sticking out of the bottom. Yes, that area is designed for parking your power adapters and cables. I also designed an opening on the sides in order for running the cables through. So today, most of the devices are using more and more universal charging ports like 
USB-C for Android or lightning cable for Apple stuff. All you need is one or two of those adapters and simply share the adapters among different laptops or phones or devices when they are done with charge. So this neat and then compact design of the charging station can be placed in a corner of the office, somewhere in the living room so people can charge devices of the day. And at the same time, it provides a nice and a clean uh, management of the devices. Hopefully this video will give some ideas to build your own charging station for your home. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.